Hey everybody, Suzy Q here at Q Aquatics. And today we're going to be checking out one of my summer tubs. This one's got my Celestial Pearl Daniels in it. Galaxy Rasborough. CPDs. Got the cutest little nano fish. Let's go check it out. And this is where I put my CPDs. Celestial Pearl Daniels. I put four in that I had in my tank. And when I came out, I have not been able to find them. Here's I had these swimming sperm-like things. I don't know if they're some kind of larvae, but I was hoping the fish would love them and eat them up, but I can't find my fish anymore. So I hope it wasn't a mistake. Do I make a mistake work by adding more fish? Um, well, if you're Susie Q, yeah, that's exactly what you do. I'm going to add more fish. <laughs> so this is my third tank. I had this blue barrel last year and it worked really well. I drill holes in the side for when it rains, it wouldn't overflow. Right now, I'm my friend gave me these creeping jennies from his yard. They, some had roots on them, some didn't. I put them in soil and then covered them with rock in there for now. Hopefully I can get them to uh, grow. And I got some water hyacinths only because I wanted a lot of roots. Some of my runaway bio balls from the pond as I find them, I toss them in here. And then I got some of my plants in here like Anubis. I think that's Anubis Cafolia. So then when I went to the store, I saw they had some, I think I bought four more, a little bit smaller, acclimated them. So I should have seven Galaxy Rasboros or Celestial Pearl Danios. I'm not sure what their real right name is. And the more I look into it, the more confused I get. So because I love acronyms, I'm in HR and I love acronyms, it's my CPDs. And that's what I'm calling them. So this is my blue tub with CPDs, and I'm so hoping that they breed for me. Stay tuned for some updates. Thanks for checking out my summer tub with me.